We all know that under Obama, our southern border is about as porous as a cheesecloth. But what most of us don't know is that there's an ISIS terror camp just eight miles south of El Paso. Oh, and for those of you who don't know, El Paso is still part of the United States. So just how difficult would it be for ISIS soldiers to march north for about two hours from their camp in Ciudad Juarez, Chihuahua? Not hard at all. They're just awaiting orders. But wait, it gets worse. There's another ISIS terror camp just west of Ciudad in Puerto Palomos, and it is in striking distance of Columbus and Deming, New Mexico. This is all according to a Mexican federal police inspector and a Mexican army field grade officer, and corroborated by watchdog group Judicial Watch, as well as being reported at Shubat.com. Mexican federal law enforcement officials, in conjunction with the Mexican army, found Muslim prayer rugs and documents in Arabic pointing to plans to advance on U.S. military installations, 1st Armored Division in Fort Bliss. Apparently, the potential imminent invasion of the United States is being aided by a one-two punch of Mexican drug cartels and a U.S. president signaling that he's willing to look the other way. Also in the ISIS line of sight is White Sands Missile Range. And considering there are so many U.S. military installations under Obama, like Fort Hood, that forbid U.S. military soldiers from even carrying weapons, invasion could be a veritable cakewalk, as easy as shouting, Allahu Akbar. Further information is available at www.shubat.com.